cache. So what I'm going to show right now in uh, where I'm at on the map, I'm not going to tell Steve because he's on the other team, is I'm going to jump into these uh, hovercrafts that we talked about that were coming out for the new development and uh, scoot around the map that way instead of taking the uh, roads. So get him out now. I'm gonna collect this body before I leave because it so, uh, Scott wants give me some treats. Fall off cliffs or into water. So will the map have any dangers for you as it's in itself, other uh, than the turrets? Is, is geo geographical dangers? Yes. Dangers? No, yeah. not yet. Bugs because are so pesty. Down, it's hard to sort of display uh, height. So um, right now we've just kept it to AI and and uh, and other players as far as as dangers. So um, this gets me onto the hovercraft. So that's something I'll work into it. The bottom right hand of the screen right now, you'll see a little green arrow by my uh, where I use my turret to shoot. And I click on that, and now I am locked in, and I am now driving the hovercraft. This is really cool. I love this option. And you can just scoot around the whole map. You can see it on the uh, mini map at the top right of the screen. Um, I show up as a little yellow arrow. And, and that's true going, to me driving around. Good. I'm just doing my thing. Uh huh. And uh, now I have to find another dock for me to. Uh, and there is one, lucky enough. So this is at a little island. I don't think there's anything here, though. Let's check it out. So you just come into there, into your sort of dock, and that same green arrow pointing up, once you're in here, you just click it, and it'll automatically sort of lock you into the docking bay, and then you can drive right off your Wow, that your looks awesome, that it's, it's pretty yeah. cool, eh? It's missing its drop. Like it is a bit of a drop shadow to give it a little bit of height. And I've got some... Uh, I've got some new textures to go underneath it. Which I haven't added yet. Which I'm, hopefully, I'll get it out before this build, maybe the next day or so. So now I've captured that gun. I hacked into that gun, and that gun when you're on the hovercraft was the AI's your, gun. Your damage is you take severe damage because you're completely unprotected. Good to know. So kind of, it, it gets you around the map fast, but um, so it's kind of uh, a sitting duck. Plus, on this little piece of dirt here is a little recharge station, so I'll do that. It's all charged up. Can you fire from the hovercraft? Yeah. So let's fart around this little island. I don't think there's much here. But it'd be a good place to set up a base. I don't think there's anything here. That's awesome. So this would be a great place for a base. Um, so newcomers and didn't see our first sort of walk through Don't use that mega rvr mine up close dave it'll kill you good to know pretty much like the uh, artillery right well the problem is if something's coming up up to you and you've just stuck a bunch of mines onto it it just you know brings them to you gotcha so on uh, uh if if for, for people the first time seeing this game um on the uh, right hand side of the uh, globe here is my driving left hand is aiming and shooting whatever weapon. Now to switch weapons on the right hand side here, I can switch via this little toggle so I can go from whatever guns I've installed, purchased and installed on my vehicle. Um, so that was sort of the two, uh, the, the double minigun there and then this is artillery and you can sort of move around the map where you want to drop it and let go. Uh, next time I use it you can see there's a reload thing and then you can shoot it again there. Oh, I know where you are. So those uh, those kind of cool things. No, no peeking. <laughs> on the uh, left-hand side, I'm just giving a quick uh, update and tutorial just on the basic stuff for new newcomers. Oh, cool. On the uh, on the left-hand side, where the drive is, you'll see there's a two times and another symbol, another symbol. Well, the first symbol here with the uh, shield is exactly that. On the right-hand side, back to where my gun is, above it is a little shield button. So as soon as I hit that, I have my shield enabled. And there's a little timer that'll tick around and to show you how long that shield's going to last. Once it's done, shield is down, and you're back to your regular defense. Uh, the next thing I have here, I believe, is cloak. So we can see it's recharging right now on the right-hand side. Once that recharges, we'll be able to enable the cloak. 
and you'll see that a lot. I was chasing a couple guys and they just disappeared, and and it's a so great way to get away. Capacity thing at the bottom there, Dave. I don't know if you noticed. Yeah, I just I just mentioned that. Yeah. And uh, and then the next thing is a two times. So with the two times, we'll just let that charge back up again. And the two times is a two times zoom, which is really cool. So if you have the sniper uh, rifle enabled, um, you can get a nice long distance shot. So I'll click on that, and there you go. It gives us a nice look at the entire map. So we'll jump back in our hovercraft here, and we'll go take some more spots on the map. So we hit our little arrow button there. We're locked in, and off we go. My back's to the stream now, okay, Tank? My back's to the stream. Nice. All right, I'm back in action. I'm moving out. <laughs> oh, someone else in hovercraft. So, there's certain docks all over the place. It's just a matter of finding them and learning the map. Uh, this is quite a big map, so I'm going to sort of jet around here until we find them. Oh, oh, Jesus. Stay away from that. I think there's a dot somewhere along here. I'm cruising down here, and, and uh, this is pretty much in blue territory. Actually, what we'll do... So let's go straight to number five. I don't think anyone's going to expect us to come in on number five there and try to take that. So let's go see how well defended five is. And I hate um, those poppers. The poppers are the worst. Uh, they're the hardest to kill, and they just, when they're on you, they're on you. They're really hard to shake those. Yeah, but the thing is, you know, they, they pop, but they don't capture the point, right? They just stop you from capturing the point. Oops. A There's a dock. Hey, we found a dock. We found a dock. All right, let's line this up. Hovercraft is very touchy. And you get, and you get. There we go. Locked in. Let's cruise all the way down to five and see if we can capture that. Switch back to our double guns. Oh, there's a charge station here. Actually, we don't need anything. We're pretty good shape. Um, so let's just carry on. Get off me. Can I get through this? I can't. How the fuck am I supposed to get through this? Hey, let's capture this guy while we're here. So what did that give us? So right now we have one turret on our right-hand side of the screen here. I'll get rid of the mini-map for a second. Um, two mines and one wall. Bring the map back Where are you, in. Dave? Don't you worry about it. Let me turn around. Oh, get off me, get off me, get off me, get off me. There we go. So how can I get... There, I need to get around this. And go the back way here. Here we go. So there's a back way. Ah, we have a wall here too. So I think I've entered where blue spawns. I think I might be out of luck. I think I need to get back in the hovercraft and get out of here. Yeah, I've locked myself in here. Okay, let's grab this guy really quick. See what he gets us. Our capacity is 24 out of 50 things, so we can actually collect quite a few things here. What does it give us? Two walls. He's busy chewing on that wall, so we won't worry about him. And this is the great thing about, about this game, uh, especially when it's the uh, larger maps, is that you can really just sort of screw off on your own and just sort of start collecting stuff. So when you do go to take a base, 
you do have a couple turrets you can put down, maybe some walls, uh, things of that nature, so you can actually uh, have a decent uh, defense. So you're not just relying on your rig, your rig alone to uh, hold down that, that point. So we can't seem to get through that way, so we're going to go find another way down to five. We'll go up and the back side here. Uh, the top there, you can see how long this actual game's been going on. So one day, two hours and 22 minutes and six seconds. Um, at the very top is your uh, capture point. So number one has been captured by Red, which is my team. Two is still up for anybody, uh, which means the AI has probably got a pretty good stronghold on it. Can we get through here? Oh, we can't get through here. Okay, so we're going to have to go all the way around. Let's enable our uh, two-time zoom here. See if that helps us a bit. This is all rocks. This is all rocky terrain, so we can't get through here. Shit. So hopefully the bridges are open down here. If they're not, then we're going to have to figure out another way around. Uh, three has been taken by blue, four is still up for grabs, and five has been taken by blue. Now even though two and four seem like no one maybe has them, there could be someone else's defense there, but the AI has moved in and destroyed the sort of defense around the actual capture point, and uh, there may be other, uh, maybe other defense there, so we got to be careful. So let's see if this bridge... Ah, this bridge is o is open, so we can't get through, I don't think. Yeah, we can. But there is a dock over here, so let's just do this. Lost yet, Dick? 